Hi there, my name is Jackie uh, from Small Pet Select and today we're going to talk about the importance of selecting the best hay for rabbits. Now we all know that rabbits eat hay and lots of it and we all know that hay is essential for a rabbit's diet but one thing that can be a little more challenging unless that is you were brought up on a farm which most of us weren't is knowing what type of hay you should feed and as well as knowing the difference between good quality and poor quality hay. So in this video we're going to take a closer look at hay, really just looking at the very basics of what a rabbit owner should know when purchasing hay for their rabbits. So first we'll talk a little bit about the two different basic types of hay that are available. As you can see in the pictures above there's grass hay and then there's legume hay. So grass hay, well you've got different types of that such as Timothy, Bermuda grass, orchard grass, rye grass and blue grass and grass hay is lower in calories, protein, calcium and phosphorus than the legume hay and they're also higher in fibre. So legume hay, they include types such as alfalfa, um, also known as lucerne and clover grass and conversely these hay are higher in protein, calcium and phosphorus and calories and slightly lower in fibre than the grass hay. In general, most rabbits need uh, just a good quality grass hay uh, because it's high in fibre, low in fats, protein and calcium. And within all the, all the different grass hays, Timothy hay is, the, is definitely the most popular option and probably the easiest to get hold of as well. However, if you are in a situation where you, where you can't get hold of Timothy hay, then any other grass hays will, will still work fine for your rabbit. Now, there are some instances when uh, you need to feed a legume hay, such as alfalfa, to rabbits. Um, these, this includes baby rabbits, growing rabbits, uh, pregnant and nursing mothers, and really any other rabbit that are in need of extra calories. This might be uh, rabbits that uh, may be aging, uh, problems keeping on weight, or convalescing after an illness or operation. So once you've bought your hay, you need to, well, even before, before you buy it, you need to check that it's of good quality. And so what are the signs of a, of a good quality hay? Well first of all look at the colour, which should be a light to dark green colour and there should be little or really no yellowing of the stalks at all um, and if you smell it, it should smell really clean and fragrant um, and if you chew a strand it should almost be sweet to taste. The stalks should be pliable and not break easily and there should be no dust at all or any foreign matter such as other plants or dirt and there should definitely be no mould. Um, mould appears as black or white spots. So poor quality hay would have little to no smell at all, uh, might have mold, some mould or, and or some dust and it'll be very brittle and breaks very easily, might contain lots of foreign plants and colour wise it'll be yellow or brown. Um, once you've seen the difference between good quality and poor quality hay, um, it, it becomes quite obvious um, as, to which is, as to which is which. So when it comes to hay and rabbits, this quality really does matter. Um, poor quality hay, so stale, yellow, crushed and chaffy, the, your rabbits simply won't eat it or they won't eat much of it and you'll end up wasting lots of it and putting it in the trash. Um, and meanwhile your rabbit's still hungry and will be begging you for, for other food, sugary fruits or other items that aren't as healthy as hay is. But on the other hand, if you feed good, fresh, green, top quality hay, um, it's highly likely that your rabbits will, they won't waste any of it and they'll really enjoy it. Uh, so it does actually work out at far better value for money. And it's also important to keep in mind quite just how important hay is to your rabbit's health. They so need the fibre for their unique digestive systems and they also need it to grind down their teeth. And just in case you didn't know, a rabbit's teeth grow constantly throughout their life and uh, for this, they, because of this they need to be constantly chewing on something fibrous to wear, wear those teeth down and hay is the perfect, the perfect medium for this. So this really increases the importance of feeding the, the best quality hay to your rabbit that you can. Your rabbit will enjoy eating it and they'll be getting enough of it in their diet and that's going to help avoid ever having to take them to the vets for some serious health problems that can occur if a rabbit doesn't get enough fibre in his diet. Okay, well hopefully that's uh, helped a little bit about how to, how to recognise good quality hay. Thanks for watching, it'd be great, we'd like to see you again soon and if you fancy leaving a comment or, or uh, dropping by our Facebook page, uh, that'd be wonderful. Okay, and bye for now.